Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Hi guys and welcome to another Fool of the Week. Now this week's Fool is a man called Matteo Salvini. Salvini is the leader of the far-right anti-immigrant, anti-EU party. And you can see here he's laying some flowers at the Ukrainian embassy or consulate here in Italy and um, showing his solidarity with them, with the refugees and the country. Now, Salvini has an interesting past. He has showed solidarity, as you can see here, with the Ukrainians, but he's also showed solidarity with other individuals. You can see here in the European Parliament posing with a pro-Putin t-shirt on. Once again, showing solidarity with, you know, <laughs> whoever needs it. And he also has posed at the Kremlin wearing this t-shirt, which is showing uh, Vladimir Putin in some sort of military attire. There have been allegations that Salvini's party, the League Party, have received money from uh, from the Kremlin. He has been invited there on a number of occasions. And, you know, he used to have significant influence in the country. That has diminished somewhat. So he likes to take advantage of situations, try to, you know, improve, in, increase his um, his position in, in society. You know, si once again, here appearing to show solidarity with the Ukrainian people. But a problem with this t-shirt was, well, it came back to bite him in the behind. I want to show you this clip. So this was Salvini in Poland. He went there to, once again, take advantage of the situation. Uh, he wanted to meet with some refugees for a photo opportunity, but it didn't go as planned. <laughs> Twojego przyjaciela sorry. zrobiła, we are, we are, co tak naprawdę sorry. Sorry. zrobiła we tym are, ludziom, are, którzy tutaj ilości 50 tysięcy dziennie przekracza granicę. Prosiłbym, żebyśmy wspólnie pojechali, wspólnie pojechali. Właśnie pojedziemy zaraz do środka dla uchodźców i pojedziemy na granicę, jeżeli będzie pan w tej koszulce. Zapraszam pan, panie senatorze. Look, look at Salvini's face as he sees, oh, okay, that t-shirt. Zapraszam, panie, panie senatorze. No respect for you. Thank you, sir. You have a chance to condemn Putin right now. Pagliaccio! Buffone! 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 Metti la maglia! Metti la maglia! Metti la maglia! Ha cantato il mutuo! Metti la maglia! Metti la maglia! Cosa stai aiutando? Sei un pagliaccio! Vai a casa! Vai a casa! Vergognati! Metti un butto in due mani! <laughs> Wonderful. So uh, I'm sorry I wasn't able to translate all of what the Italian journalists were saying. Um, uh, thanks to my friend on Discord, on Discord for translating the Polish, what the Polish man was saying, which is ironically, the Polish man is from a far right party there. But Salvini wanted to go to Poland to take advantage of other people's misery. He wanted to use this as a tool to elevate him him politically in in Italy he's somebody who likes to take advantage of of others and uh, in order to boost his own image and this one didn't go very well as you can see you know you, the Italian journalists are calling him out shame on him uh, you're a clown and his response was good job you're doing a good job he knows he he's a buffoon he knows he's a fool and he was really hoping maybe to take a few pictures with some desperate people and publish this on Facebook or on Twitter or on other social media outlets in order to convince people back home, no, 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 he may be anti-immigrant, but he's a good guy. It's all about promoting himself and it's come crashing down. And that's why he's our Fool of the Week. See you next time for our next Fool of the Week.